Today we're taking a look at the brand new Lux Diaper Clutch from 12 Little. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nicole and on this channel we talk about everything from bag reviews, product reviews, and more. So if you're new here, definitely consider subscribing. Today we're going to take a look at the brand new launch from 12 Little. This is the Lux Diaper Clutch. You have seen me talk all about the regular diaper clutch versions, versions 1, 2, and now here we are with 3. And there have been some major updates that make this bag absolutely stunning. I can't wait to talk through those with you and show you how I have it all packed up. So let's go ahead and jump in. Let's go around the outside of the bag and then I will prop up the camera and show you what I have packed inside. One of the new features of the Lux Diaper Clutch is this gorgeous handle right on top. I do want to say right off the bat it comes in two patterns, Croc, which is what this one is, and Snake. And the handle is brand new to the bag. It is cushiony and soft. And I think this bag just looks so chic. Nothing about this bag says I'm holding diapers, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so you can use this as a mom bag. You can use it as a diaper clutch. It's so versatile. I absolutely love it. And it's at a great price point too. I'll link it down below. One of my favorite things is the way that the logo or the company name is embossed on the front. It's cut out and it just looks really nice and really subtle. The second thing is this handle. The handle is brand new for the, or the Lux Diaper Clutch. And um, it's cushiony, as you can see. And it's just perfect. I, I love that they added that on there. Of course, the bag will also feature the zipper stop on either side, just like previous versions. Um, and the zippered pocket right on the back. Right there. The pattern of the inside material of the bag is the leaf pattern, um, which is really nice and neutral and will allow you to kind of see everything that you have in there without any trouble at all. It does come with the included changing pad, which I'll show you here in a sec. So now let's go ahead and jump into how I have it all packed up inside. Before I show you how I have it all packed up, I wanted to show you guys these little pouches that 12 Little came out with. I have the croc and the leopard print and they just clip to the strap. There's actually a little loop right here um, and that's where I clip it. I have a video all about what you can hold inside of these in this black one right now. I have um, my lip gloss. I have a little pull and go, two little pull and go cars for my kiddos. And then in the other one, I have it loaded full. The nylon has a little bit more stretch to it. So I have a bunch of hair ties. I have my silicone reusable straw and I have some hand sanitizer all in this little pouch. They're super cute to clip to the outside of the bag. Let's go ahead and start with what I have in this back pocket first. Back here, I thought it'd be a great place to put all of the masks for our family. I have my kids' masks and then I have my own. And then next to that, I have a little card case um, with cards in it. But that is a fairly roomy pocket. It, you could definitely fit more back there. Now let's get into the main compartment of the bag. Like I mentioned earlier, they have the zipper stop so that the zipper can go down halfway or you can pop it open just like that, turn it to the side, and you can unzip it all the way down so that it will lay flat, which is what I'll do for this video. All right, here is what the interior of the bag looks like. Like I mentioned earlier, it does come with a lightly padded change pad, which can fit nicely in that back pocket. Right now in this back pocket, I have my hand sanitizer from Touchland. There we go. And then I also have a package of wipes. And I have a package of wet ones. Since we're still living in these crazy times. <laughs> In the middle, there is a mesh pouch, which is totally removable. So if you need some more space, you can take this out and fill up the inside. In here, I just have a foldable hairbrush, dental picks, soap sheets, um, little trash bags, my all over ointment from Tubby Todd. I have my lippy clip with my chapstick um, attached to the zipper pull. And then I also have these little individual boogie wipes because it's coming up on flu season. On this opposite side, I have two pull-ups. I could fit a lot more because these elastic straps are um, very generous here. There's also a loop right here where you can put a bottle or a sippy cup. I have my daughter's um, Nook cup here, just to show you. And that fits in there no problem at all. And then you can just zip it up and be on your way. Um, love the amount of space that you get in this bag so, so, so much. Okay, now let's pack the bag for a night out. First off, 
what is that? Just kidding. But really though, I'm like dying for a date night without coronavirus flying around. <laughs> um, I have this all packed up for just me. And in this outside little pouch, I have a face mask. Boop. And I also have my AirPods. Okay. Then on the back of the bag, and I do want to say I'm an overpacker, even for just myself. That's just how I made, guys. <laughs> so this is packed full. Um, in this outside pocket, I have my wallet from Dagny Dover. That's the travel accordion wallet. And then I have a Touchland hand sanitizer right there. And that pocket is a little bit tight for me because I have so much inside. Um, but let me show you. So. I'm gonna go ahead and unzip it halfway with the zipper stops and show you that if I needed to just pull my phone out really quickly, I could totally do that. I love the zipper stops right here. It just makes life easier. <laughs> so let me go ahead and undo those and lay the bag down flat so we can take a look at what's going on in here. All right, so in this middle removable mesh pouch, I have a bunch of stuff. I have my lippy clip still attached here with my chopstick. I have a little travel size native deodorant. It's like a little deodorant ball. I don't know if you guys have seen these, but I love native and I saw that they had these little bitty ones and I love them. Um, I have my Tubby Todd Mama hand cream. I have these little soap sheets to wash hands while we're out if we needed to. I just kind of always keep the all over ointment with me at all times because I use it myself too. I have a bunch of lip products. I have my travel scissors. I mean, you just never know, never know. I have some dental picks. I have a couple of boogie wipes. Does anyone else like to use boogie wipes for themselves? I kind of do, even as a grown up. A foldable hairbrush and one more extra um, chapstick. So that was in that removable mesh pouch. Then under the elastic strap, I have my pill case. And then in this pocket, I love how it packed up. I have my keys nestled over here. I have my little tiny pouch from Stony Clover, and this has inside of it um, just random stuff. I have some Hello Kitty chapstick. I have a potty cover if I'm out and about. I have Kleenex, and I have an extra mask. And all of that is squished inside this little pouch from Stony Clover. Um, and then behind that, I have a little Rifle Paper Company notebook and a pen. Um, I always like to have a little notebook with me, kind of at all times, honestly. Um, and this is just a really cute little notebook from, um, I think I got it from Anthropology. I'll link it down below. But that is how I would pack the 12 Little Lux diaper clutch if I was out for a night, date night, with my husband, or just out and about without kiddos. So there you have it. You can use this as a diaper clutch. You can use this as a mom bag. The versatility of this bag um, is really awesome, especially since it looks so nice and chic on the outside. Um, I think they just did a phenomenal job with this. But that is what I had all packed up in my Lux diaper clutch. Okay guys, so that is it for the video today. I hope that you enjoyed the look at the Lux diaper clutch. If you did, be sure to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see all of you guys again in my next video.